Well, hello. So apparently I have a little bit of a special recipe uh, according to several of my friends. Now we've all seen with coffee by now, who hasn't? I make it a little bit differently and several of my friends have tried it now and apparently it's like bomb. So <laughs> here's how I make that. Obviously the most important part of with coffee is the coffee part. Can't really have it without that. It's a specific kind that I've used um, pretty much the entire time that I've made this stuff is the Folgers Noir Golden Dust, which you can find really at your local stop and shop or Big Y, probably anywhere. Um, I can put a link to it down below though if you really can't find it. In here though is actually a little bit more of a blend. So I put in some instant espresso and mix it in with the instant coffee. So it, it gives it a little bit of a stronger coffee taste, which I feel like just kind of adds to it so obviously the gist to this is to do equal parts of the coffee sugar and water so basically i'm just gonna do one tablespoon i kind of go like a one tablespoon per person kind of ratio so say if i'm making like three cups of it i'll use three tablespoons then of course one tablespoon of sugar and you can really use like any kind of sugar. Uh, if I had raw sugar, then I'd probably use that. And then of course the next thing is to add one tablespoon of water, which I'll be right back. All right, we got the water in here and now we froth. Now here's the thing um, that I think sets my version apart a little bit. Normally when people make Delgana coffee, they like to whip this coffee mixture until it's like the consistency of peanut butter. Um, I don't do that. I mix it like just enough where it's like nice and frothy and foamy, but I, I don't make it as thick um, because it doesn't mix in very easily if you mix it till it's like really like the consistency of peanut butter, like I said. So if you don't mix it as much, it will mix in to the coffee so much easier and that way it all kind of becomes one thing. All right, so this is kind of the consistency that we're going for here. And then we're going to need to get ice. Now you can really use any dairy that you like, I am going to be using almond milk. Another thing that I like to do is add a little bit of flavor. So I use one of these delight things. I just got the French vanilla one, but we've used caramel before. And also another thing that I um, do sometimes, if you want to get a little bit fancy with it, um, is put a ring of like chocolate syrup on the inside of the glass. It's amazing. Now for the moment you've been waiting for. And now of course you gotta stir it. That's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if you try out this version of the famous TikTok coffee, then um, let me know in the comments below how you like it, and uh, yeah, subscribe, like this video if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!